new day has come. On this beautiful morning, the night sleepers are getting up to be able to go out for hunt. This is Lacerta, Iram, Debo. This slow animal sleeps very briefly and then cannot come to itself until noon. What's this? A treat? It is impossible not to take such an opportunity. But did this creature have not noticed the trap? Unfortunately no. But who made it? Who's that? A man let. Please note his muscular figure which he easily obtained thanks to his small size. His intellect is higher than that other animals, because this species had to develop its wits by not engaging in direct confrontation with other individuals. You can see that someone has just earned a meal. But what is that? Another meal? No, it's a male, the natural predator of any manlet. His physique is completely different from his prey, he doesn't need exaggerated muscles to signal his strength. His expression speaks for itself, he just wants to signal his domination. Uga, Uga. Oh no, manlet runs away without his meal. Unfortunately the man shows no interest in the lizard. The man's weight and his awkward hands make it impossible for him to climb onto the tree for a meal. A man is marking his territory by signaling to others that he is the highest in the hierarchy. Uga, Uga. Manlet may finally come down to the ground, but he seems not satisfied with the man's message. Nowadays, Manlet has managed to survive, but his life is still filled with fear by other, larger predators. Adult males don't treat Manlets as equals, but like cubs, constantly reminding them that the opposition is not important. The powerlessness to gain a position also manifests itself in the dating zone, where halflings are unable to attract potential mates. What do you mean by that? You know, I got myself a pair of new high heels. And? And I am afraid that then you will be shorter than me, and we will look stupid. But you already have your heels on. But they are a bit bigger. Honey, can you see this couple? They look silly together, don't they? Yes. Manlets spend nights all alone pouring their regrets on internet. Even there, no one gives them any chances. An interesting phenomenon are individuals which, thanks to their superior genes, have grown to enormous sizes, among them, there are those who envy small size of the manlet. This is a very strange phenomenon that occurs more and more these days. You lucky bastard. Can this species survive? When will they finally be accepted in our communities? Or maybe we as a society, have to finally grow up.